all night. gonna just go yes. hog wild here. I recently moved in with two guys I don't know very well. The house is very nice, but the boys have a pretty extensive collection of dead things. Not hunting trophies, more like animal bones and dried out insects and just all sort of random found things. I think this is actually really cool and I've always wanted to start a bone collection. This took a turn? <laughs> but never knew where to start. What is a non-creepy way to ask these guys to help me start my own dead things collection? <laughs> That's from Afraid of Seeming Creepy in Atlanta. Are you, you here? here? Yeah. Cool. That's a now, good, yeah, decisive. Are you worried that when you ask them, how do you start collecting bones and stuff, they say, well, step one, find a roommate who doesn't know you very well. Yeah. And asks too many questions. Sure. Uh, on the inverse, if you wanted to start a bone collection, stealing theirs and then murdering them, you just made the collection bigger. But now you've made yourself a huge target for bone collectors. Oh, oh no. I heard about a big score in Atlanta. If you want to be the bone collector, you have to murder the current bone collector, <laughs> adding their bones to the massive pile. I, I, would, um, I would also say that worrying about being creepy by being enthusiastic about like, Trying not to be creepy is way creepier in that sense. If you're yes. like, yes. nice yes. bones. Cool bones. Cool Where bones. Give me some of those Oh, though, I'd like to get some regular bones. <laughs> they some know, regular, normal, not weird at all bones. They know it's creepy. They don't collect them because they're romantic or erotic. They know it's like a creepy thing. Yeah. So you should acknowledge that. That's fine. Hey, these are creepy. Let me get in on it. I love it. Yeah. Hey, you have done, you have had your desired effect on me. That's creepy. I you love, are interesting. I love creepy stuff. I love Beetlejuice. <laughs> I love, the movie and the musical. I love pumpkin. I love, I love pumpkins. <laughs> I love all the creepy ghosts and everything. I love, I love it. skeletons. Skeleton. Or did you procure the bones? <laughs> hey, who's this you? character? <laughs> this, is, this is Peter Stormare asking about bones. Okay, one more time. Where well, did you procure the bones? I like him very much, yeah. You gotta get bones from somewhere, folks. They don't just fall out of trees unless the bird has an accident. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think yeah. of a self-inflicted accident that a bird could do in a tree that would make bones shoot out of it. <laughs> Can you imagine a bird falling out of a tree and thinking, what could I have done? <laughs> Oh, if only I, a bird, was prepared for falling. It's got to be like, I'm going to slam my face into this tree. What, what kind of bird am I again? I think I'm a woodpecker. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I forgot. This is, brings up another good point, though. Are your roommates carrion birds who oh. have brought home their mm. sweet treasures? Uh, I have... Hi. I have a Patreon now. Uh, if... If you'd like to do that. I only have one tier. It's $2 per video release. Uh, yeah. And if you go on there, you'll see all the stuff you get. And also, you should subscribe. Because that's the thing that you should do. Because I'm making more of these. Okay, bye-bye.